more style, more tech, more agility. BMG ZST, it's the more you've been looking for. On air, online, and on your smart speaker, your place to wine, dine, and have a good time. Fitzy's, open seven days. Hit News Briefing. Hello, it's Matt Layson with you. Cost of living concerns have surged across the country with a recent survey indicating it's doubled in priority over the past year. The Resolve strategic study shows 48% now prioritise cost of living compared to just 16% in January 2022. Healthcare, aged care, the environment and climate change were identified as other pressing issues. The United States is promising more investment in Australian defence manufacturing and the processing of critical minerals including lithium. The announcement came during an urgent quad meeting involving the US, Australia, Japan and India. Those talks were due to happen in Sydney this week, but President Joe Biden pulled out so he could tackle the pressing debt crisis back home. Today marks one year since Labor stormed back into federal government, ending nine years in the wilderness. Finance Minister Katie Gallagher reflected on the past 12 months, telling Nine they don't take their position for granted. The work of government goes on, so you know, making sure we taking the opportunities that come from the net zero transition. Um, the voice to parliament referendum obviously is going to be a key priority in the later part of this year. So there is stacks of work before us. And Canberra begins running new ads today ahead of the upcoming voice referendum. It's about a conversation Aussies are being urged to have about the constitutional change. Debate over the issue has sparked a more than 10% rise in cyber abuse. Wherever the journey takes you, you can rely on Century Batteries to take you there. Proudly Australian made since 1928. Visit centurybatteries.com.au Police Carfusi is in doubt for state of origin. The Dolphin star was placed on report for a high shot during a fiery clash against his old side, the Storm, as they went down by eight points. Captain Jesse Bromwich was quizzed about the intensity on field. Yeah, I think the first time you play against your old club, that's always going to be the case. Um, for me, the thing with Fussy is we we love it when he goes out there and he's aggressive and swinging arms and that, I'm not too sure. But In today's action, the Bulldogs take on the Titans and Raiders. Oh, oh, for the rest of the day in Toowoomba, dropping to lows of 5 degrees overnight. Sunny tomorrow, a top of 17 degrees with some southeasterly winds. Tuesday and tops of 18. And for the latest local news throughout the day, download the Listener app.